What's up you guys? Welcome back to another episode of Sweet Man. But yo, anyways, um yesterday I got pulled over by the feds still. So I was going allegedly 44 over the speed limit. So it was like an 80 kilometer zone, construction zone. And allegedly I was going 124. And also I was following an ambulance, allegedly. Uh, so I got a ticket of 330 which that's like my first ticket still. There you are right now. We're going to uh, wrap MTO. I'm trying to go get my um, my fenders fixed. I don't know how much that's gonna cost me. So we'll see, but allegedly it's supposed to be under warranty, but they said this one might not be under warranty. So we'll see what happens. All right, and also make sure you guys like, subscribe, and enter your chance to win the $200 giveaway. You dick? Yalla. Alright, so you guys, so like I mentioned y'all before, like over there, yeah, what doesn't make sense? So, I got this scratch. Apparently it was um, vandalism. I'm not too sure because it makes no sense. I'm gonna take you on the other side. But however, it kind of went into the paint. Like the paint is kind of scratch. I don't know if y'all can tell from the camera, but the paint is kind of scratch. But anyway, so like to get this with wrap, it's gonna cost me about $400 for both fenders. So now, moving on on the other side. As you can see, you do have like a stripe all the way here. I feel like someone kind of hit me on purpose. I don't know why would somebody do that, but hey. So let me know what you guys think. Like, was this done on purpose? Because right now I'm like, you know, tripping. Like, yo, what's going on? Like, everywhere else looks okay to me. You know what I'm saying? Everywhere looks fine. But from that side, let's see over here. All right, that's just dirty. But yo, so you guys, like, let me know, like, what you guys think. Like, did someone actually hit me on paper? So, like, you know, because that side, it makes no sense. On, on the left fender, it makes no sense. Now I'm going to spend, like, four bills uh, to get this wrap again. After spending close to three bands to do it so it's crazy you know it's a car i think i'm definitely gonna have to let this car go my next uh wrap that i'm gonna do for my next car i don't know yet maybe something subtle but i don't know we'll see all right i'm gonna keep you all tuned all right y'all yeah like Something's yeah like scratch it on purpose right Actually, it's not that bad. It's coming off easily. But you see that there is... No, I just... I feel what you mean. Right? The other side is really bad, yeah. I have to get it with wrap in Toronto again. I go hit my front bumper. Oh, they will bump. They will wrap it. it, yeah. In Toronto. But that's the last wrap. Like everything else. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the rest of the car. Like it's just the insurance, right? So I have to get it with wrap from Audi. Yeah, they did the whole bumper. I had egg thrown at me on my front hood. Egg? Yeah, an egg. Seriously? Yeah. yeah, the wrap. You had to, like, I had like a big dent on it, but the insurance covered it, so. Downtown. They're crazy. Downtown here? No, downtown Toronto. Yeah. Why are you driving to just go through an egg? You just throw an egg. I parked, no, no, I parked. So, like, I left the car. I just saw the egg flying through my hood and I'm like, okay. Yeah, it's crazy. Ah, uh, you guys, so here's the update. So we're done from the wrap MTR. 
Um, right now we're gonna go to Fish and Chips, which is just right behind me still. But here's the update. So the wrap got got done. Then I had to do the rooftop as well. So that was free. It was under the warranty, uh, the five years warranty. Um, I'm gonna show you guys in a bit. But so that's done. However, so I just spent four hundred dollars for two fenders, which is my fault. And I'm spending four hundred dollars actually with taxes that I came to like four sixty. Um, it's crazy, but to be honest with you, this car gotta go. I've had so much like you know bad experience with this. Um, in a sense, like uh, before I got thrown egg at me on my hood. Thank God it got covered by the insurance. But the insurance covered just because I got into an, well I didn't get into an accident, but someone backed up into me, right? So that's what happened. But yeah, I'm gonna show you all the uh, the finished product of it. So on this side, this was the side that was damaged really bad but now it's looking pretty clean like nothing ever happened to it however on this other side that was in super damage the paint got damaged kind of did get damaged so as you can see over here you can see some cracks over here so the wrap is good but the paint i feel like the paint wasn't painted properly or maybe the wrap wasn't done properly let me know what you guys think was the wrap that wasn't done properly or it's just the paint because i see imperfection of it yeah it might be imperfections that was done on it i don't know let me know what you guys think down in the comment below like over here, I feel like it's in perfection. But regardless, this car gotta go. This car gotta go. Cause I remember over here, that's where the paint, it got scratched, it was over here. It wasn't over here. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna have to take it back. Because it's not the paint. I don't think so. Let me know what you guys think. And then over here. So over here this needs to be sticking out. But it seems to be okay. We got we done. Like I mean I came last minute, right? To get the whole the whole thing done. So um, I mean from far it doesn't look that bad. But once you get closer to it then that's where you see yeah, this is kind of bugging me still. Um, yeah, it's on two sides. One over here and one over here. They took me in last minute. I might go back and go ask them to redo this. But anyways, yeah, so that's what's up. I'm gonna catch you guys later. you guys your dad has the cute is still i just want to give a sh massive shout out to the guys uh rap mto for hooking it up i came back just like i said i was gonna come back but now i'm a little bit more you know i'm more satisfied with the job right so it's done properly i'm you know i'm gonna show you guys just now but shout out to this guy yeah 
Shout out to Rap MTL still. If you're in Montreal or like anywhere in Canada and you want to like, you know, get your rap properly done, come to Rap MTL. If this video is not sponsored by any way, I didn't get any special treatment or whatever. They just services proper. But anyways, I gotta take a look. So from before, now they're looking crispy clean. So when they did peel up the wrap, um, there was kind of um, over spray. So they fixed that up properly, and now it's looking clean still. So if you guys are gonna be buying a car that's wrapped, make sure you wanna inspect the paint and get the records for the car still. If not, you're gonna have problems. But yeah, look at that. That is freaking good. There. To be honest with you guys, I'm like satisfied as fuck. It's looking clean. You check this out still. So they do stuff like this. This is freaking good. Um, wrap MTO. Damn. But yeah, you guys, I'm happy. That being said, I'm gonna have to end this video here. You know, I'm kind of tired. It's sweaty, it's hot. It's been a hot day, it's like 34 degrees. So definitely, um, if you guys you know, haven't subscribed yet, make sure you guys subscribe. Give a thumbs up for this video, you know, and also participate in the giveaway. Follow your man's on Instagram, x underscore sweeterman, and the sweeterman show. You feel me? And it's a $200 giveaway, so my voice is a little bit low right now. I'm really tired, like you can see. I'm like, it's heat. So, all right, I'm gonna catch you guys on the next one. Yalla. <laughs>